too. He's not gonna spruce up. Well, with only 14 ready cash. He probably shouldn't anyway. But he's almost ready to get promoted. Oh, jeez. I knew this would happen, and I fell for it. Oh, boy. I'm gonna have to sell at least one shop. Uh, I don't want to get rid of that tax office. I don't know, Mario just uh, got all the uh, lucky breaks here. And now Diddy is adding to it. I'm not gonna bid on that one. Or even that. Gosh, Diddy is really on the verge of going bankrupt. Not gonna buy any of those that he just sold. I don't want to pay that much. second shop there, but whatever. Bianca better win it. Otherwise Mario's gonna have four out of five shops there. Yeah, the starting price was 90. It's already <laughs> quadrupled that at the most. Well, Mario got it by default, unfortunately. Yeah, Bianca can definitely get a Monopoly there. And honestly, I wouldn't mind that. See, I, I want Mario to buy it just so that he can lose some more cash here. Here he goes through my checkpoint pretty soon. It's still going up a bit, the checkpoint. Alright, will Bianca go up and give me some money? Well, there's a, there's a sale. Wish it could have been a lot more though. Ugh. Okay, um, I'm gonna need the club at some point, but we can go for it later. I don't mind paying Mario 95 here. But if I can roll a big number on the next turn, I can easily, I will easily go for that diamond at the door. Oh. I could have a fourth shop here, but, um, let me s Ugh. Uh, I'll go 600 at the most. Bianca chimes in. 
Oh boy. Oh, I really want that fourth shop. Uh, whatever. Should have let Mario pay the uh, whatever that was close to six hundred. Uh, considering he had only four hundred ready cash. There he goes, buying a shop right there. Uh, she doesn't roll it too. Well, she has a chance to land on my tax office next turn. But of course, the odds of that are just next to none. Alrighty. Three. Alrighty, um, I could go up to Bianca's 87 or Mario's 85. Well, let's just go this way. At least I skipped past both his tax office and that, uh, 2730 shop. At least I got past those. Mario just got his next promotion. Oh geez, he just spent 9.99 capital there. That's gonna increase his stock by <laughs> 22.10. He's pretty much got this in the bag. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Oh, well. There's a big sale that I wanted, but uh, I'm almost 10,000 behind Mario, and he's definitely on the verge of winning this, and I can't even crash him. 72. Take 20 times the number of shops you own in gold coins by rolling an odd number. If I roll an even number, I have to pay 20 times the number of shops I own. So we want to roll an odd number. Come on! Ugh. Just a hundred. Uh, so, I could have earned a hundred, but instead I have to pay a hundred. Okay, what suits will Mario go for? Alright, he's made that a thousand now. Oh boy. He didn't even invest stock in that district where he has that circus tent. Hmm. He could have been a lot closer to the goal if he would have invested some stock there. Well, let's see what happens here. Can I buy some? No. Just to try to crash him, but no. It's not gonna work. I can only buy up to 34 more here. Uh. No, <laughs> not gonna pay his thousand. No, uh, you know what? Let me start start this over. It'll ask me to buy stock. Um Just 20 more.
All shops in the district fall in value by 20%. Oh. Oh my god. Uh, Diddy. Why did you let this happen? If it would have if it would have happened in Mario's Monopoly district, he could have lost a lot. Oh man. Uh Oh my goodness. Just a huge props to Mario. He just uh, dominated this. And pretty fast, too. Okay, still need a spade, but if I can uh, land, in, land on my tax office up there, I get a 5% rebate. Shops expand by 30 percent. Oh, can I get that 30 percent back? Come on. Oh, my goodness. This game is just teasing me big, big time. Oh, my gosh. Yep, that just gave Mario the game. And it looks like he just won it now. Uh, nope. Still got to wait one more turn. And he's gonna get a big commission till his next turn. Oh my gosh. I don't know what else I could have done to try to win this, guys. Uh, I, d I definitely should have taken some chances on investing stock or even just uh, buying some shots, but let me tell you. They only started me with just 1,500 gold, and there's quite a lot of expensive shops here. That's why I couldn't really afford to buy a lot of them, or even buy a ton of stock. I didn't even know where a lot of this potential was going to be coming from. Ugh. Jeez, Mario. He just showed no mercy. <laughs> yeah, look at Diddy's pose right there. <laughs> I'll bet he'll never get tired doing that. Bianca came in second, I came in third, and Diddy in fourth. I take away nothing. <laughs> Mario gets silver property potent and silver stock supremo, of course. I don't even get any trophy or net worth stamps. Gosh. Yeah, it was kind of close until halfway through and Mario just ran away from everybody. And I mean just ran away. And this only took 33 turns and only 45 minutes of recording time, so... Usually standard rule sports could take w at least an hour and a half or two hours to record. But this one only took 45 minutes, which is very, very strange. Yeah, I only received just three sales compared to ten payments. And Mario never made a single payment. How crazy is that? I don't think I've ever seen this many turns and this much uh, property uh, purchased and not have to pay anyone else. This is another good reason why he just ran away with us in the second half of play. Oh, man. He, he just showed no mercy. Nobody had a chance to catch him. Oh, man. Anyways, we'll go ahead and close it out there. And um, I'll end it off here. Thank you all for watching the next Fortune Street Board, the Bowser's Castle on Standard Rules. I will see you guys in the next Fortune Street Board, whichever one that's going to be. Have an awesome day. So long.